XBA1C test is the level of hemoglobin glycosylated hemoglobin in blood see in our all our rbcs red blood cells contain a protein called hemoglobin when excess blood glucose circulate in the blood that gets trapped in this attached to this protein and you know the life span of an rbc is 90 days to 120 days so as long as the rbc stays in the circulation the hemoglobin attached glucose also remains so if some person who has high blood sugar round the clock round the year or for couple a couple of months or weeks then they are prone to have high glucose attached to this hemoglobin component so by measuring this hemoglobin a1c which assesses the previous 3 months blood glucose value roughly you can assess your glucose diabetic status so somebody the normal value will be 5.4 or less and from 5.5 to 6.7 you say you are a pre diabetic state and above 6.7 it is a confirmed diabetes so when you some the blood sugar random values will fluctuate uh, from time to time meal to meal so this value is more dependent dependent and reliable for confirmation of diabetic status <clears throat> particularly above 45 years you have to screen yourself if you are not a diabetic or if you don't have any other risk factors you screen once in a year or twice with this test and if below 45 years if you have other risk factors or family history of diabetes and or women who had pregnancies during deliveries then they need to check it later to confirm whether they are diabetes or not though they know one has diabetes in the family still they the chances of getting diabetes is there because the diabetes particularly type 2 diabetes is influenced by so many factors it's not genetic alone so environment factor food and lifestyle factors everything so so even if your parents or sibling not diabetic but still one can have diabetes provided he ha- he doesn't have a healthy lifestyle like sedentary lifestyle overweight obesity high triglycerides and less walking and again some genetic genes which control the insulin secretion and pancreatic st- cell uh, glucose utilization they can have mutation and they can uh, predispose to environmental factors to induce diabetes so a person can have diabetes even if the family members does not have the same